new year, new booking system, new calendar, resolutions, all those amazing things. Today we're taking a look at Draft, which is currently available for just $59 from AppSumo. Now Traft is an online scheduling software that your customers will love. And honestly, I've implemented the tool this week myself, and I absolutely love this deal. I think it is a fantastic value. I love what they're currently doing and where they're headed. And I do think that this is a very serious competitor to the likes of Calendly or Simply Book Me, even Acuity. But let's get into it and I'll show you kind of my thoughts, my feedback, some of the things that I've learned this week and hopefully help you determine if it is for you or not. I'm not going to read to you the AppSumo page, but I'm going to say that I picked up License Tier 2. However, you can probably get by with License Tier 1 which limits you to 40 employees and 10 total custom features and paid integrations. Now I opted for license tier two because I don't want to be limited on the custom features and integrations in the future as they expand and hopefully as I get more in depth with my booking and scheduling. Now what I'm going to be scheduling on this is real estate photography and those related services. So depending on what you're doing, maybe it's like salons, barbershops, et cetera. Maybe you're doing it for your clients. No matter what you're doing, Tract should be able to actually adapt as long as it's a service-based style. And they also have Google Meet and Zoom and all of those. So if you do a lot of online consultations or things along those lines, then Tract should actually work for that as well. Now jumping into the tool, I absolutely love the interface. Now I have no employees. I'm a solopreneur. Two words entrepreneurship. So when I set this up, I'll go ahead and show you the booking website that kind of comes with it. I've put my own subdomain on it. So it's book.rocketstripe.com. And these are my current services. You can kind of use this as a widget on your current website, or you can use it as a standalone website yourself. At the top, you're going to have a login or book appointment. You can also search for services. And if we come in here and book an appointment, I'll continue as a guest. You can select one of my services. And then here I've got the upsell offer, uh, which honestly is going to increase your average order price over the course of a year, I would say, by giving them the option to add on a virtual twilight right then and there. You just select that. Or if they want to add a video tour, 360 tour, real estate video, all those different things, we'll click continue. And now they get the calendar. And if you want to custom move this around as far as the order flow, you can do that with Traft. And I think that's pretty cool but I've kind of left it as is. So you select your appointments, then you select what you're going to be doing. So if we come over here to Saturday, now currently I haven't launched this yet, but I'm going to be launching it very soon. So my availability is completely open through Traft. And if I go ahead and select, let's say 145 on Saturday and then click continue. And notice by the way, all of these colors, they're to my brand. So it's all customizable. Now, if I click continue here, it's going to ask for my name, my information, and then I can select the payment on site or I can take payment right then and there with Stripe. Now you can turn this off so you can only do on site or you can turn off on site and you can only accept credit card through Stripe, Authorized Net, or PayPal. I believe those are the three payment solutions currently. You can apply coupons and run a referrals or first shoot free. That's sometimes an offer that I'll run out there. I'll say, hey, I'll shoot your first shoot for free and I can give them a coupon code. Then they can come here and they're going to save $155 on this shoot. Pretty good deal if you're a realtor in the Myrtle Beach area. So moving on to the back end, that's kind of the user experience. And once they confirm, they're going to get an email confirmation as well as SMS text confirmations and reminders. And then on the back end, I'm going to jump into the calendar and I'm going to see the actual appointment. Under the appointments, I'm going to be able to look at all of the appointments. I could look at it for a period of a year and I can see how many appointments I did. My employees, it's just going to be me. But if you have multiple employees, you can see how each employee is doing, how many appointments they're doing, all of those different things. Adding an employee is as easy as entering their name, email, phone number, those types of things, uploading a profile picture so it is friendly giving them some days off because you can't work seven days a week. You can assign services. You can have your working hours, you know, depending on the default, which I have it set from 930 to five, but your default could be, you know, whatever you want. And then of course, assigned services. These are all of my services. If I jump into the services here, adding a service is super simple. You click add service. You've got name, price, duration. Then you can do buffer times before and after. 
You can do employees. You can change the color so that it, it's different colors on your booking page. And then you can add a description with links and all of those great things. What I would love is the ability, and I don't think you can currently do it, but uh, this is going to be a little bit nitpicky. I would love the ability to add in videos or like in the event of a 360 tour, an embed code or something along those lines in the descriptions so that you could give a more uh, aesthetically pleasing uh, video type thing. Right now I'd have to link out to that stuff, which isn't a huge deal, but it's better if you can keep them on that page. Uh, obviously, so that then they can go ahead and book. Now for your extras, you're just gonna come in here and add any extras you have. This is that upsell or cross sell opportunity. I'm using it a bit as both. So if you select a photo service for me, you're gonna get the upsell kind of into the virtual twilights as well as the cross sell into my other services so you can build your package together. Now for the gallery, this is where you're gonna upload all of your photos, or in my case, I've got some photos of real estate properties, but for your locations, you can click an add location button, and then if you've got multiple locations, it's all taken care of. So one of my ideas there is, sometimes I'll shoot up an hour away, two counties up, and then I'll shoot two counties down. So I've got a four or five county radius, and I could add a location day, and then I could, if, if my business takes off to the point that I can get enough shoots one day up in that location, then I could kind of do it like that and compartmentalize my schedule accordingly. So that's just something I've got in, in mind, but right now I'm not busy enough where that's really a feasible thing. Under finance, we have invoices, settings, transactions. So we'll be able to see all of our invoices for the year. And one of the things that I think is worth pointing out is on the booking website right here, when you go in, it gives the option to pay right then and there via credit card or the option to pay on site. If they select pay on site, the system will generate an invoice that then they can pay later, or of course they can pay it on site, and that will be marked once they book as a pending invoice. So you'll have to go in and say that they actually paid, or you'll have to send them that invoice, send them an email, and they can pay you later. So that's probably what I'm going to be doing, but I love the option to give a realtor the shot to pay you before you even do the work, because that's obviously the more everyone wants to get paid quicker. So that's something to point out. That's something I was a little concerned with. Taxes, they've got it all taken care of depending on what your needs are. Coupons, this is exactly what I was talking about. First shoot free, that's my code right here. If I give this code out to a realtor and I could add a custom coupon code, let's actually add a coupon here and I'll show you. If I wanted to do like AI profits and then I could add an expiration date, usage limit and limit per user. So let's say the first five people I wanted to give a free shoot to, I could do that. Once that code is gone, it is gone and all is well in the world. Traft is truly impressive for everything that I kind of need. Now up here in the top, we have our settings. And this is uh, important to point out depending on how you do your appointments. You can set your default times as low as five minutes. It starts at 30 minutes. And then every appointment's 30 minutes apart as far as your times but through buffer times and default time slots, I've got it currently set to 15 minutes. You can get that down depending on if you're doing an intro call, maybe you're like a free strategy call or otherwise. Be sure, I think this is like if you wanna add a lunch break or a particular uh, time each day that you give breaks or you block off your calendar. Now what I would love, and some of these advanced calendar systems will do it, is I would love some feature that makes me look busier than I am, depending on if you could kind of show like, oh, I've only got one appointment there, three appointments here. And then you can adjust those settings depending on you know how much work you actually wanna do and you don't have to go in and manually do it. That's just something to think about, something that I don't know if it's possible. I think I've seen it, so I do think it's possible, but uh, I don't know. SMS notifications and histories. Here you'll see I have $20 in SMS credits now, one of the uh, bonuses, let's call this a bonus for sticking around to this point in the video. When I bought this and went onto my Facebook, they retargeted me with some ads and they actually gave me $10 in SMS credits 100% for free by using a code. Uh, you can get those $10 in credits to try it out. I didn't know that, so I'd already bought 10, so now I've got $20 of credits. But if we come in here to add credits, what we'll see is for each credit, it's about two cents per segment. So you can send about 500 segments for every $10 in credits. So for me, and by the way, what a segment is, is all of these different texts, I believe. 
So like when the appointment's approved, when it's pending, rejected, canceled, rescheduled, reminders, and then the follow-up. The follow-up's gonna be crucial here. So I've got thanks again for choosing us. By the way, I'm trying to grow my reviews on Google this year, so leave me a Google review. Now notifications is all the same thing. Now you can go in and we'll get into the advanced features here in a second. I'm gonna go quick through all this because this is just payments, setting up that type of stuff. Features and integrations. This is what I wanted to go into. This is where on the AppSumo plan, what you'll see is you get 10 total custom features and paid integrations. And then on license tier two, you get unlimited. So I think the 10 is gonna be good for most people because currently I'm only using nine, uh, but it is something to keep in mind. Uh, depending on what your needs are. And this is what they currently have available. So they've got coupons, custom domains, custom fields, which I've got to actually add a couple of custom fields. I want to collect just some basic information on property address and stuff like that. So in the booking process, you can have custom fields where you can ask questions and it's almost like a little survey before they book. So you can get that information out of the way. Uh, very, very cool stuff. And anytime you need more information, they have documents. And these documents are actually quite good. I was able to set everything up without any problems. So that's custom fields. We've got extras. Again, that's the upsell, cross-sell opportunities, group booking, multiple locations, online payments, SMTP, emails, special days. So this is like, again, I don't know exactly what it is, but it overrides a general working schedule for those days. So this, however you want to use it, um, but if you want to view the documentation and read it, you can see that there. So beyond that, we have integrations and they're gonna, so they're gonna integrate with Facebook Pixel, Google Analytics, Tag Manager, Calendar and Meet, MailChimp, Outlook, Sendfox, Zapier, and Zoom currently. So once I activate some of these and set up my Pixel and some of that stuff, I will be over uh, the 10 custom features, which is why I opted for license tier two. Again, that's kind of depending on what your needs are, your business, et cetera. Users and roles, if you have employees, VAs, anyone like that, and then websites. This is how you customize your lo website look and feel. So you can come in here to the look and feel and you can change up your colors, add your logos. You can even add custom CSS and JavaScript. So that would be, I think, if you wanted to throw like a chat bot on there or pop-ups, any of those types of things, you can do that there. And then here we do have custom fields, but you can add a custom field and that would be uh, something maybe we could add. Let's see here. If we wanted to add like a checkbox here and we wanted to say, is this video good? Is this video good? Yes or no? So that's where you can get some general information. One of the things that I'm going to want to do is a property address, like I said, and I'm going to make that required. And then I'm going to save the changes. And then if I jump back in and go into book now, and we'll just go through real quick and we'll select one. And what we should see, what is the property address? Right there it's set up and now we can capture the property address. So this is good for whatever type of custom, anything that you need uh, on the website, on the booking forms, all of those great things. But if you need to embed this into your website and you don't wanna use theirs, then you can simply copy this iframe, paste it, you can redirect the URL after a successful booking, which I'll be doing that. And then of course you can also track your analytic conversions and do all that type of stuff through redirects. At least that's the way I've learned to do it. Account settings, you can make it so that guests can sign up or they have to register in advance. And then you can also do it so round robin style employees where you know you get it in and it just goes round robin or you can have them select an employee for example at a barber shop round robin or they could select a specific barber so that's kind of the extent of this tool trapped i think it is fantastic it's definitely worth that 59 dollars to me 119 dollars on the year it's still going to come in cheaper than any of the other calendar tools that i looked at and I was considering as I was upgrading 2022, I used Sweet Dash last year. Sweet Dash is just, it's a bit too cumbersome, a bit too complex. Uh, Track looks a lot easier. I'd love to hear your thoughts down below. Hope all is well. Happy 2022. I'm back. AI Profits every single week this year. I'm going to upload a video and I'm already on January 6th making this one. So I'm already kind of pushing that, but we're going to do it 100%. Hold me accountable. Hit the like button, subscribe, all those great things. And I'll see you in the next one.